everybody, it's Ben and Beta, and today I'm unboxing this 7-in-1 solar connector that allows you to connect to just about any power station that's available. So this connector is going to be able to connect to both this XT60 connector on this All Powers R1500 and this Blue Eddy AC60, which has a DC709, as well as DC8020, Anderson, basically it has everything. So let's take a look at what we get in the package. All right, so in the package, we've got a nicely wrapped cable system here. So a little bit of cable management, which is great. We've got all the various different connectors. On one end, you're gonna have your MC4 connectors, which will connect to the solar panel. And on the other end, you've got, again, pretty much every connector you could ever imagine that you're gonna need for connecting to some kind of solar power generator. You've got your XT60, you've got your DC709, and your adapters for that cable. And then you've got your Anderson plugs and several other DC connectors, including the 8020, which works with the Jackery system. So you basically have everything you need here for all major brands. And what this does is just makes it super easy if you have multiple different solar generators and one panel that you want to connect to those. So let's give this a try. So again, super easy. Connect to the solar panel using the MC4s. And now let's go ahead and test the R1500 and see if it works. All right, so we're going to be using XT60 on this one. And we can indeed see that it's pulling power from our solar panel, no problem whatsoever. It's about 62 watts right now. But now let's see if it's gonna work with the Blue Eddy as well. So we've unplugged from the R1500, and now we're gonna go ahead and plug into the Blue Eddy, which should be this cable right here. And let's see if it works. And we can see immediately that the Blue Eddy is indeed pulling power at about the same rate, 57 watts, 58 watts, something like that. No problems whatsoever. So that's how you set up and use this 7-in-1 connector with different types of power stations and any kind of panel that uses an MC4 connector. And what this allows you to do is buy an MC4 extension as long as you want and then connect it to anything you want to. So that makes it really easy if you need to get a longer cable for your solar panel. Anyway, that's a quick unboxing and how to use this 7-in-1 connector. Thanks for watching.